In 1983, you were a young actor with the huge success of Roots a few years behind you. How did you get involved in Reading Rainbow? Um, I had already done uh, a couple of seasons of a PBS show called Rebop that was produced out of WGBH in Boston. Um, and so had been introduced to um, the, the public broadcasting mission um, where children's programming was concerned. And um, I was on my way to Africa and um, in New York doing a Live at Five interview and they, were, they had just uh, started looking for a host for the show and saw me on this interview and tracked me down before I, I had a chance to leave the country. And, and, and told me about the show. Would you be interested in, you know, hosting a half an hour of children's television that brought them back in the direction of literature and the written word? And I was like, I'm in. You didn't audition for this at all? No. They no. just came after they, you? They, 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 they did. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of fans were sorry to see the show go off the air. How much pressure was there to get the relaunch just right? Well, uh, you know... That was the biggest pressure, Kojo. Um, the danger of failing to meet the expectations of the brand. It would have been easy to disappoint folks, and that was absolutely what we did not want to do. So that, that, kept, that kept us up, that kept us awake at nights. Did learn and interact with technology change the way you thought about the show's mission? It, not only did it change the way I, 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 I thought about the show and its mission, it changed the way I addressed the audience. Um, because after, after becoming a father myself, it, it became really obvious that the easiest thing to do would be to speak through the lens of the camera to my children. So, in other words, you just, like, never went home? You just... <laughs> Here I am. No, I, what, I, what I mean was that, 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 that talking to them became um, my focus in terms of my connection with the audience.